Dr. Chris here with the Ask Dr. Chris Show. Uh, today's question comes from uh, Simone. She would like to know, you know, she says that her partner has depression and she would like to know how can I help, you know, my partner. I would actually say or challenge this question and say the best thing you can do for your partner is to look after yourself. So while your partner is getting medical treatment and they're obviously getting the appropriate medical advice, the best thing you can do is not to forget your own health. Oftentimes when we're giving to somebody else out of the, you know, the love of our heart and out of the care, we forget to look after our own health and our health suffers and we lose self-confidence as a result. The best thing you can do is to continue to exercise, you know, to continue to eat well, look after your stress levels, have time out, time where you can have a distraction. Oftentimes if you're doing a hobby, it's something that you can do with other individuals and for half an hour, an hour a week, you can forget about the problems at home. So that's a really good strategy as well. Do get counselling as well, not because there's anything that's suggested, you know, to be worked through in your perspective, but to, to, to basically download and find some coping strategies with your own stress levels and dealing with the stress and potentially some of the emotional backlash from home as well. So do seek some counselling. Your local doctor is able to do a referral for counselling or you can refer yourself. So that's some suggestions to try and buffer that. And lastly, do you know gather the support of your friends and family. Often mental health is still taboo. You don't want to talk about it with friends and family. You don't want to burden them. But friends and family often do want to hear about you know your struggles. They do want to share with you. And so do find someone that you trust. Do download. Do say to them, you know, I, I just need a shoulder to cry on. And so they understand the nature of, you know, your conversation. So yeah, I hope that helps and all my best. Thank you so much for your question. Please leave other questions below. I hope that you're loving the Ask Dr. Chris show. If you would like to see more of the Ask Dr. Chris show, please press subscribe.